Hello families, here's a look at our classroom. As we come in every day, we find our hook, we hang our backpack and our coat, and then we get whatever we need out of our bin on top. We then enter our classroom with our lunch bags and our water bottles, and we come and we find our little cubbies. So as you can see, each cubby has the child's name, picture of a water bottle, picture of a lunchbox, and a hook for their mask. We then sanitize our hands and enter the classroom. Here's our room. Looks very different this year because of COVID. That whole back shelf is extra toys all packed up so that we can allow the children to play with clean toys each time. Our block area, our art area for hanging our art. And then you come into our kitchen area where the children can play with food. So partly due to COVID, we have to switch out the food each time a group of children is finished. So the food is at a minimum. So it allows for the children to play with sanitized food each day. When the children arrive, we have out on tables, what we call um, incentives or uh, provocations. So this is the magneto table. The kids love the magnet tiles, building and shaping different things. This morning, we're gonna do some germ art. So we're doing some blow painting, which we have a straw for each child. And we're gonna do some germs, talk a little bit about germs and washing our hands. And here's our art area, which is free for the children to take as they want. We have a spotlight area, which we'll talk about later on in the year. Our classroom expectations. And then we have maker stations. So each maker station, each child has one. So the girls are together. Uh, we've got a group of boys here. In their maker station, they have a maker's box. It has glue, markers, crayons, scissors, Play-Doh, and some Play-Doh cutters. So they have all of those items to use on their own. And then they also can use any of the items that we have in the classroom at their maker space when they so choose. We have some sandboxes that they can bring to their maker space. We also have water play. We also have magnetic tiles, Legos. This looks like a chaotic mess, but it's actually uh, organized chaos. We know what's clean. We're able to uh, sanitize whatever we need, whenever we need it. And then the kids can play at their maker station or with one other child. So here's our class. There's Miss Jen. We also have a clean and dirty bins that encourage the kids to help with the clean and dirty so they know if they've used something, they put it in the green dirty bin. And then when things come back, they're in the blue bin. So at the end of the day, we pack everything up from our cubbies. We go back outside to the hallway with our masks on and then we go outside. So here's a little look. It's not as cozy as we would like, but it is the best we can do with all the COVID restrictions. So I hope you like it. If you have any questions, just ask Jen or I.